It is a strange feeling to be here at nine o'clock in the morning and nothing is going on. Just a week ago, this was one of the busiest hours of operation and now it's a ghost town and it, it's overwhelming to consider how many small, medium and, and big businesses have literally had to lock their doors because of the current situations going on around the world. And I get it, there's intent, there's a reason, but it doesn't take away the stress, the worry, the uncertainty. It's still there, there's still questions, overwhelming amounts of questions and very few answers as to how a lot of us are going to get through this situation. So with so many individuals reaching out to me and wondering, what the hell are you guys going to do? I figured it'd be worthwhile to document for you exactly what we're going to do in this situation. There's opportunity amidst chaos, always. We're very fortunate that we already employed a hybrid coaching model here at the facility. We work with our clients in an online and in-person setting, and we have clients all over. They don't live near us. Some of them live as far as three, 4,000 kilometers away. Because of this reality, even though it was a little bit chaotic and messy, we've been able to sort of pivot and transition our clients to programs based off of the equipment that they have available at their homes. For some of them, that's nothing right now. Uh, for some of them, that will remain nothing because they have no intent to purchase equipment, they'll just wait this out. Some of them have very, very effective home gym setups. Other ones are going out and purchasing equipment now. Regardless, this has proven to be what will inevitably save us from having to close our doors permanently uh, because we have the capacity to work online indefinitely. Then on top of that, we'll be expanding our online coaching business model something that was kind of a small percentage of what we did will now become a very large percentage of what we did, which I guess it's beneficial that a lot of our systems were already in the works to do that. We've just been forced to prioritize that sooner than we had expected. So I guess you could say it's not all bad. It's definitely not all good. It's not optimal, but it's certainly better than it could have been had we not already been preparing and implementing the systems and strategies that would allow us to handle this as smoothly as we currently are. There's still a lot of hiccups, uh, there's still a lot of speed bumps, there's still a lot of uh, miscommunication getting across to clients, but we're doing our absolute best to kind of make things as streamlined as and efficient as possible. Understanding the circumstances, it's not going to be perfect. It's a lot of imperfect action at this point. So I'll make sure to keep you guys posted on exactly how we are going to not only come through this unfortunate situation, but how we're going to thrive in it. How we're going to serve more people than we ever have before. How we're going to bring more value to the table than we've ever brought before. How we're going to overcome what currently seems like an insurmountable hurdle. We've been working around the clock, creating content and ensuring we have the right systems and strategies in place to serve you as efficiently as possible. And tonight, we'll be dropping a four week dumbbell and body weight only workout program that will allow individuals who are equipment strapped and training from home to still get a progressive structured workout in for the foreseeable future. If you're looking forward to seeing exactly how we rise to the challenge during these trying times, make sure you subscribe because we're not going anywhere.